On today's episode of Vegan Cooking with Bobby and Brent, we're going to be showing you how to make these crepes <gasps> of the vegan variety, Bobby. Yeah, oh my god, Brent. Next on Now, now You Know. So yeah, Brent, we're going to be making these awesome crepes. Yes. Here's what you guys are going to need to make these. It's pretty easy. Oh man, Brent, first of all. Oh man, Bobby. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm awkward today, Brent. <laughs> I'm always awkward though. I say crepe, crepes. You say crepes. Crepes. Mm -hmm. I, I say crepes. I okay. say crepes, Brent. Yep. Some people say crepes. Yeah, crepe. Crepe. I'm gonna get a crepe. I feel like I'm gonna say crepes, and I'm gonna continue to say crepes. Yes, crepes from crepe. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, we got our little hipster hats on because we're yeah. going to, you know, the cafe. Yeah. The cafe, gonna, like in a college town. We're going down to Cambridge, gonna get ourselves some crepes. Gonna drink some coffee. You know, the thing with making crepes is that's kind of crucial. What? Is you need to have a nonstick pan. Whoa, wait. You're telling me yep. that if you're making a crepe yep. and it sticks to the pan and you peel it off and it rips apart, that that's not okay? Um. No, it's not. Yeah, so we, we need a nonstick pan, but you know, most Teflon nonstick pans have some nasty chemicals in them that we don't want to eat or breathe. Wait, Brent, I have Teflon. Yeah? Is that bad? Um, you know, it's not great. It has a PFOA, PFOA, <laughs> and it also has PTFE, which are um, chemicals that are used in the nonstick surface of the Teflon. And um, those are not so great for you. When you heat them up, it actually comes into the air and you breathe it in. Uh, and that stays in your bloodstream for a long time. Also, uh, yeah. <laughs> you, okay, you okay, buddy? I'm yeah. just like realizing how bad this is. Like, yeah, and I mean, they're still doing lots of studies on it, but some early indications show that there are links to them being carcinogenic. What? So, again, still, what? they're still kind of actively studying this stuff right now, but so far, like, it's not looking great for these chemicals. Well, Brent, yeah. <laughs> say I have a pet bird. Yes, you know? like I do? Like you do. So you thinking about getting a bird? Yeah. You gotta and get a little budgie. Showing, uh, there's little no budgie way that pudgy, my pudgy bird... Pudgy the budgie? Yeah. <laughs> pudgy the budgie. Yeah. No way that my bird sitting in his cage in the other room is gonna be affected by this, right? Actually, it's extremely deadly for, uh, Parrots. It's uh, not good. What? Yeah. So um, you having a bird can't yeah. even use Teflon. I can't use Teflon at all. What? Um, it, it, they could literally drop dead from just breathing it in. Wow. What are we gonna do about that? Whoa. Because we don't want it stick. We're in luck, buddy. Mm, whoa, we're whoa, in luck. whoa, whoa. Because we do have other options, and today the option we're gonna be using is this nice stone ceramic pan that I got here. <laughs> This is made by Osery or Osery. I'm not actually sure on the pronunciation, but this is from their um, Stone Earth line of pans. Oh, listen to that. So this is a ceramic pan, and it works just as well as any other nonstick pan. You know what, Brent? And it's actually not that expensive, too. Maybe we'll put a link in um, down below to an Amazon for our affiliate link. Oh, yeah. So you can help us out. Get us a couple shekels from Mr. Bezos. Yeah, Mr. Bezos paying this us purchase. the big bills. They're really not that expensive at all. I think I got mine for about 20 bucks. $20 yeah. to save your bird. Save your bird and also your own health. Wow. You consider. So, Honestly, and you can still make some tasty H crepes. This is awesome. I'm really excited. First, combine all your dry ingredients into a bowl. Next, take all your liquids and also combine those into its own separate bowl. Now, combine your liquid ingredients with your dry whisk until smooth. So our batter's all together. It's looking nice and thin, which oh. is what we want for crepes. We don't want it to be too thick or else you end up getting more of a pancake than a crepe. Yeah, you want a crepe. You want it to be real thin. You want it to be nice and thin. So we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna bring this over to our special stone ceramic pan. Oh yeah. All right, that's starting to feel warm enough. So what we're gonna do is take our little ladle here. Ladle, ladle, ladle. Ladle out some batter and then once we do Let's so, I like to uh, spread it around. Spread this. Spread that out. It's pretty much to cover the whole bottom of the pan if we can. That rhymed. Mm -hmm. I love it. All right. So we're going to let that cook for a little bit. Brent, we finished our crepes. Yes, we made our crepes. They didn't say we could do it. We half barely the, did, but we did it. Half the burners weren't working on our yeah, stove. Yeah, I don't but, know what's going on lately. But uh, we, we, get, we managed to get through it. 
So, so I think we should just jump right in. Yeah, I think so. I think so. Let's just give it a taste yeah. and see what we think. And we, uh, just for those at home, in case you're wondering, we put some toppings on of our choice. Yes. Yeah, so you I, can put whatever you want on these Yeah, things. I did some uh, hazelnut spread. Bobby did hazelnut, peanut butter, and coconut. Some coconut. <sighs> Cause I love me some coconut. Where are you coming down on this oh, one? Oh, me first, you want me yeah, to go I'll first? Yeah, I'll let you go first. Brent, I'm gonna try and sell this to you guys because people in the comments think I'm not believable. <laughs> they don't think you actually like the stuff you're eating? So I'm gonna change my face. Okay. To, to be what my grade is. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna give this one an A plus. Wow. See, that sounded more fake to me. Yeah, I know, right? But I think that this is an A plus. Apparently on the internet, natural and normal speak <laughs> for you com comes across as fake. Yeah. But whereas maybe fake comes across as natural. I maybe, don't know. who knows? But don't yeah, know. A wow, plus, I, definitely. I, I'm surprised, I full A plus. You know, it, this, I always say something good and then I say something bad. Yeah. I do wish mine was a little more cooked, yeah, definitely. Yours well, was I, definitely an earlier crepe where the pan, we, we literally had to switch burners three times because yeah. like one was like cooking too much of the outside, one wasn't working. Yeah. And then the third one yeah. kind of did the trick, which is what I got. I got the good one. Yeah, and so, you know what though? I can, even though that the outside's a little soft, mm -hmm. I can, the taste is just amazing. Yeah. And I'm gonna say A plus. Okay. Definitively A plus. That wow. is amazing. Okay, cool. I'm gonna go A minus myself. <laughs> yeah, I think part of that, I was just getting frustrated with the cooking of it, so I think that colored my experience of eating yeah. the crepe, because- Well, that happens. At home, this usually goes pretty smoothly, but the burners here were pretty inconsistent, so I was Weirdly. getting a little frustrated by that. I would say taste is really good, though. It's maybe slightly doughier in the middle, mm -hmm. again, because the burning wasn't, or the burning, the cooking was inconsistent, mm -hmm. um, but uh, yeah, overall, I still think it tastes really good. Mm -hmm. I, I love a good crepe with some hazelnut spread, so. Yeah, it's amazing. Thank you so much for watching, guys. We're, we're running out of steam here, so yeah. let's wrap it up. We're running out of steam. I can't hear anything. My ears have gone deaf. Yes. It's so good it made Bobby lose his senses, so. Yep. I'm, I can't even anymore. All right, so thank you so much for watching this episode. Like, sub, Patreon, Patreon. comments. Comments. I've been Brent. I've been Joe. And you're a schmo. Bruh. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs>